you guys. Uh, thanks for checking out the latest Straight Rate Pest Controls uh, blog. Uh, today, the latest blog is going to be about the brown recluse coming at you. <laughs> just kidding. It's just a piece of paper, just in case you didn't see that. Um, anyways, uh, the brown recluse is uh, also known as the violin spider or the fiddleback. The reason why they call it that is because on the on the top uh, surface of the spider, it looks it has the shape of a violin, or it gives off the appearance of a violin. So, um, anyways, that's a identifying feature. Then they're also uh, they're about three eighths in length, uh, three eighths of an inch. I'm going to put that picture back up there for you to see. Uh, the males are typically a little bit smaller than the females, and um, they have a width of three sixteenths of an inch. So. Uh, give you an idea of what you're looking for there uh, when it comes to a brown recluse. Now, getting into some details about the brown recluse. Uh, the brown recluse injects a venom when it bites you, uh, or anything for that matter. It injects a venom that is a bacteria that actually kills uh, skin cells. Um, typically, uh, it won't leave any scarring or anything like that, but uh, on many occasions there have been uh, areas where scarring has been left or severe damage has been done. Um, they, anybody healthy uh, will be affected slightly, but any seniors or children uh, can cause death. Um, it can cause death and even healthy people if bit in, the, in a bad place. So just uh, use caution uh, if you ever see a, the brown recluse. I'm going to put that picture back up there because I want to embed it. This is what it looks like. Woo, woo. Um, okay. Uh, brown recluse, uh, they lay eggs during from May through July, so that's when you'll see the most active uh, recluses. Uh, they're notorious for staying uh, in dry areas, uh, typically untraveled areas. Uh, warning, if you are moving or if you have moved recently and you have cardboard boxes, please use caution. They are notorious for staying near cardboard boxes underneath them, around them, behind them, stuff like that. So just use caution. Uh, if you see a brown spider that looks like a brown recluse, well, you want to go ahead and uh, kill it. But use caution. This, once again, brown recluse. Now, uh, brown recluses are actually very difficult to treat. Uh, recommend a professional like, my, like myself here at Straight Rate Pest Control. Um, you can call us if you want a treatment. Uh, treatments typically take about six months to control. Um, to control an indoor infestation of the brown recluse spiders, uh, yeah, it's about six months. Um, also, the recovery time, if you were to get bit, you can expect it to take about six to eight weeks for recovery. Sometimes it could take several, several months. Um, if you were to be bitten by a brown recluse, please, please, please remain calm and immediately seek medical uh, attention. If you can, get the spider and put him in a jar, kill him, anything like that, do that and take it with you. Uh, that will help in solving exactly what recluse it is. There are 10 different uh, recluses, but the most known is the brown recluse. Anyways, you're probably wondering why I haven't been on film lately, and it's really because, um, to be quite honest with you, and, and I do want to uh, put out there warning and caution, uh, I was uh, bitten by a brown recluse uh, and unfortunately it was on my face and because of the bacteria uh, killing venom um, it is, uh, I'm sorry, the skin killing bacteria that they shot out uh, really did some damage on my skin on my face so I'd just like to caution you, please use caution, uh, if there's any children watching this you might want to turn them away uh, this is not good but I think it's important that you see what it looks like uh, for a bite so Hold, bear with me. Okay, as you can see, all my skin is gone. Completely gone. Gone, I don't have any more skin. See? Skin. Bone. It's all bone. All right, all right, all right, okay. You know I'm kidding, I'm kidding, being dramatic here. I didn't get bit, but uh, I highly encourage you to uh, look at pictures if you are looking at them, uh, looking for the bites. And anyways, the next video you're going to see is us going out in the field. I will take you there next. Thanks for checking us out with Straight Rate.